Hello there guys, Billabo 10,000 here, bringing you episode 9 of The Legend of Zelda, and today we're going to be taking on the final dungeon, Dungeon 8. Now straight away, when you enter this room, or this dungeon even, you want to go straight to the left. Now, going left or right, I believe you'll be faced with Manhandler again, the big flower boss. And he's dead. Mwahahaha. And now we're going to be faced with a lot of evil enemies that nobody likes. Oh, and there are bubbles too. That makes it all the more fun. Now, I would recommend using your bombs, because there's a bomb shop outside the dungeon where you can actually refill your bombs. That is, that is needed. That is needed. That is needed. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's beautiful. He's frozen in pl Oh, beautiful. That is best room to get that in. And that is the magic book. Basically, uh, what that does is it improves the power of the magic wand by giving it flames as well. We now have flame attacks too. Uh, I can actually showcase that off now as well. Uh, so let's go over to the magic wand and let's showcase it against an enemy if we see one. Now these bubbles we just want to ignore, don't want to lose any life, so we want to just kind of get past them without any problems. Uh, what we're going to do after we get back through this room is we're going to- oh, I didn't realise you were going to keep shooting, rude. We want to go and head to the right. That is kind of creepy, they're both two different types of statues, I've just- I've literally- that's just dawned on me. want to head into here, and now we can fire this, and it's okay! Wow! That's awesome, right? My turn. Okay, go, oh god. Okay, I don't think bombs can harm us. I can't remember. No, ah, go away, go away. Okay, go, oh, I got hit. I believe, no, there, there's no hidden chest. I'm just being really stupid. Okay, let's head off this way, and let's head up into the open door where we're going to meet, uh, another manhandler. Yeah, there's another one. Hello. There we go. Now it's dead. I think we have to go up. I think there may be a right direction. I don't know. Let's try left, because I'm not sure. No, just up. Okay, I just wasted a lot of bombs. That's not good. And there are going to be some enemies in here. I haven't seen them yet because I skipped into my inventory screen. Oh, God. No. 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 Just get to the keyhole. We don't need to kill them, I don't think. I, I don't think it's required to... Oh, wait. No, it is because the door. No. That's just wrong. Making me have to kill those guys. All of them. Two. That is just wrong. I think there's a bomb wall in here at the top. I'm, I'm not entirely sure. I think there is up here. If there is, I want to use it. There isn't going to be one there, so we can skip that out. Uh, going to need our magic wand, I guess. I wonder if any of these guys will drop any bombs. I do need bombs, so... Oh god, I'm losing health rapidly. That's terrifying. Okay. Okay, so the magic wand doesn't do anything to these guys. That's good to know. Good to know, good to know. Good guy. Cool, cool. Cool. I'm doing really badly, evidently. Uh, rupees are fine. I can go and buy stuff with them, like potions. I mean, I already have a red potion, so I should be fine. That's a heart. That's something I gladly will take. Come on. There you go. Now we've got to go deal with the dark nuts. Oh god. Okay, I'm gonna get my bombs out. I know that I'm probably gonna run out of them and then I'm gonna have to go around looking for some, but... This is just not good. The lag. Oh, the lag. Oh. Oh, that was explosive. Okay. One's dead. I know that much. Come on, follow me, follow me, follow me, follow me, come on. Come on, guys. Let me at least kill one of you. Ow. Okay, one of you's dead. Fairy! 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 Come here, come here. Oh, oh, that fairy is good. That's gonna keep me alive. That is what's gonna keep me alive. Oh my god. What is this place? Is this just a 
freaking fireball extravag- Okay, I need to use my potion. I'm panicking. I shouldn't be panicking. Panicking is bad. Uh, B. Oh, yeah, that potion so good. I, I like the red potion. Red potion, you saved my life. How can I ever repay you? Alright, uh, let's... Not get our bombs out, because we just used them all. Or almost all of them. Which is still just as bad as using them all. Ah, mm, uh, okay, key. It was for a key, okay. That's okay, it, it was for a key, keys are fine. Oh, uh, there's more of you guys. I really hate these guys, just, just, just saying. Really, dislike them. Like a lot. <laughs> and the bubbles really don't help either. Because they stop me from slashing with my sword, which is really bad. Really, really bad, okay. Ah! Oh my god, bubbles. Bubbles and dark nuts do not mix at all. They should never have gone together. Come on, there you go. A rupee. I didn't even need to go through this area. That is, ow, that is painful. Oh, and there's more? Yo, no. I'm not good at fighting you guys. I mean, yeah, I've got like an OP sword and everything, but still not good at fighting you. Okay, heart. I mean, I would like to kill them in case I have to come back through this room again. Oh my god, I'm on friggin' one and a half hearts. Why did no one tell me? What, what guys, why didn't you tell me? I'm really hyperactive today. This is not good. <laughs> me being hyperactive is always a bad thing. Uh -huh. uh. Alright, one's dead. Uh, 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 you need to die. You really. Ah, get away from me! Uh, uh. Stop firing your lasers! It's not nice, and I know my internet memes. I know my memes. Yes! Okay, I can go to the right. Now, I am actually looking for a very specific object, which I think I'll find here. I don't know. Don't know if I do or not. Can't remember. We don't actually need to deal with the guys in here, but, like, the fact that they're there just shows that I need to... Okay, I think... I might be going the wrong way. At least, I think there was a bombable wall that I needed to bomb, that I didn't bomb. Yeah, I've gone the wrong way. I need to go back. Like, the boss is incredibly close by. Literally, I could just bomb that top wall in that room and I'd reach the boss. Which is kind of hilarious, considering this is the final dungeon. But, um... Oh, I have to deal with you guys. I should have come in here later. Shouldn't have come in here now. At least I'm getting bombs from the Gibdos. That's kind. Always a good time when you get bombs. Ah, It's great, right? Right? Oh, god damn it, Bubbles. Bubbles, no! Bubbles! Okay, oh, bombs, more bombs. I like bombs. I really love bombs. Alright, what we need to do, because I've ran out of a potion, which is kind of terrifying, is we need to... Okay, move away from you, plant that bomb there, go through the wall. We're after another item. It's a very specific... Oh, come on, manhandler. No one wants to deal with your crap. I mean, you die in, like, one hit to my sword. I just need to sh I just need to friggin' swing in the right way. God! Good, you died. Oh my god. Okay, so I've obviously missed uh a room or a key or so oh I can get the key. I can I can get the key from this room. That's not not this one, but the one that's in that other room that I saw. And come back. I know there's probably another key that I can actually use to get it, but I'm, I'm being practical here, guys. I'm being practical. And I'm not going to need to come into this other half of the dungeon. Uh, because I think it's only for, like, rupees and stuff. Because I'm pretty sure there isn't anything else in this part of the dungeon that I actually need. Alright, I want to get around there. There's, there's items galore over there. Give me the rupees! And the freezes. It's, it's just brilliant when you can freeze enemies like that. And they won't move. That's typically what you do when you freeze enemies, right? They don't move? Yeah? Yeah? Okay. Uh, kill you. Take your heart. Let's go back and let's get the skeleton key that we're after. Because the item that we're getting is the skeleton key, which basically, once we get that, we can open up any doors that we want. We do not need, uh, a key to open them, because that, it's, it's basically, it's a key that opens any locked doors. Infinite amount of times. Freaking awesome. Very much required if you're going into Death Mountain. Yeah. Let's open you. Let's see. Goma! 
Hi! Oh my god, I completely forgot you were gonna be here! How are you doing? It's been a while. Been a long time. Goma. It's really good to see you. Good to see you. Really good to see you. Not really. You're, you're kind of annoying. I, I never liked your mother. Oh, Goma. It, it's been far too long, baby. Darling. It's like it's been, it's been so fabulously long. Like, seriously, darling. Alright, you need to re really go, Goma. You're not even the problem, it's the fireballs. Oh my god, Goma, you are. Oh, incessantly annoying, and I've just walked into a trap room. Yay. At least it's filled with the easy dark nuts. They're the ones that you can deal with. Because they're the idiot ones. It's the blue ones that you can't deal with, because they take more than one hit to kill. And I think these guys don't have good pathfinding in comparison. Like, I mean, they're pretty similar. Oh. You hit me, that's embarrassing. I got a bomb, yay! Alright, what I wanna do... Is quickly, uh, go there. Bomb this wall. Go through, see what's in here, because I actually don't know what's in here. Ooh, secret room. I don't know what's actually in this secret room, so... This is new to me. Oh! Oh, some rupees, like 10 rupees, yes! Oh my god, that's so gonna help me. I mean, it probably is. Probably is. Alright, let's just ignore that room. We don't need to go in there. We need to go to the right, because that's where the skeleton key is going to be. See? I've missed so many rooms in this dungeon, I'm pretty sure. Alright, oh god. We've got to kill them all, haven't we? I mean, like, the Pole's voices I can deal with? Yeah, we've got to kill them. I can deal with the Pole's voices, as I said. It's the blue darkness that are going to be the problem. Wow, you aren't a problem. That's a first. Oh, and you're a problem. You're gonna be an issue. You're gonna be an issue. And you're the easy one. Alright. Let's get our bow out, because bows do freaking amazing against Paul's voices. As evidence right there. Because, bash, wow, wow, I'm good. I'm good. No, no, no. Your pathfinding is a douche. Now for the other douche. Douche McSwagakins, the... Darknut. I'm gonna call- that's your new name, Darknut. Come on, okay. There you go. Now we can go down, and we can get the skeleton key, which, by the way, is completely worth it. Obviously. Uh, Death Mountain. Alright. So now, going back to more serious mode, we're gonna go and face the boss of this dungeon, which we can actually get to, because we've seen the room just before the boss before. Now, we've been for almost every room in this dungeon at this point, so there's not really much else to, to say. It's a very linear dungeon, surprisingly. I, I was expecting it to be much more not linear, so... No. No! No! You can't make me do this again! Excuse me, I just burped. That's really embarrassing. But you can't make me do this again! That is cruel. I killed you guys. You can't. You can't put me through this hell again. Give me that. I killed all of these guys. You guys saw it. It was on the footage. That is unfair. That is an unprecedented amount of evil being spilt there. Oh my god, you are. Your pathfinding is still annoying as frick. Frick a frack, frick a frack. Oh god, I'm dead. Look, I'm I'm dead. I'm on half a heart. I can't beat the boss like this. <laughs> no, no, don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please. Oh god, Bubbles, no. I feel like you're gonna kill me. Don't kill me, don't kill me. You know what, I'm gonna try the boss out anyway. I know I'm gonna lose, but I may as well try him out. I mean, uh, uh, yeah, I didn't even get to the boss, but I can go buy some potions quickly. Now, if you notice, uh, I didn't mention this, but when you get the skeleton key, your key icon turns into an A. I just thought I'd mention that. Alright, we're either gonna go find a fairy fountain, or we're either gonna go get a potion. Uh, either one's fine. Because the potion shop that I want to go to is actually near a fairy fountain anyway, so we can actually head to the fairy fountain now, and we can get the everything else after. And anyway, that level isn't too da dangerous. Okay, I'm pretty sure that one of these is the potion shop. Yep. 
There's our potion that we need. And I want to go to a fairy fountain because I want to save the, uh, the red potion. And if I can just heal myself up at a fairy fountain, then I should be fine anyway. Right? Makes sense. That makes a whole lot of sense. Okay, let's go this way. No, 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 no. It's this way. Up here. Left here. We have to go left again, I think. I'm trying- I'm literally- I'm just trying to remember where this fairy fountain is. Uh, die. That and my, uh, kill everything, uh, twisted ego thing is- Yeah, go up here. That's a warp, uh, area, I think, by the way, I'm not sure. That's fairy fountain. Heal me. Thank you so much, you're so kind. I really hope this heals all of my health. Thank you. You're- you're so kind, great fairy. I bid you farewell. Alright, let's head back to the dungeon, then. I'm not losing my health now when I've just got it back, because I've now got ultimate power, I have sword beams, you will all lose. <laughs> nope. Uh, right here, I think it was, yeah. Yeah. Yep, kill you, get my bombs that I don't actually need, because they're actually kind of full, which surprises me a lot. Kill you. I'm getting better with this shield, though. You've got to admit that much. I think I have to go down here, yeah. Yeah. Let's go back into Dungeon 8, then. And this time, let's go defeat the boss. Because we can do it. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. We are going to do it. No man handler, either, because the mini-bosses don't respawn. Which is freaking amazing. Glorious, even. Oh, glorious. Oh, glory. Fame and glory. Alright, let's kill you. I don't even know what I was... Like, uh, half the time I do this, I don't even know what I'm saying. Like, I, I, I come out with random stuff, and I just, like, it's annoying when I come out with random stuff, because my random stuff just isn't really entertaining. Uh, okay, up the, the door. Okay, we need to go up one more room, and then right. So, bubble hit me, so I just want to run through. Uh, deal with you guys again. Hello again. How you doing? I have two potions. You're going to not live long enough to... Feel my wrath, 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 uh, feel the wrath of the gilded, I actually don't know what this blade is called, I think it's the gilded sword, but I'm not too sure, can't be sure. Alright, let's, uh, use you. And now, getting some potions, getting healed, I feel rejuvenated. The Dark Nuts of the Illuminati, by the way. That's, that's, that's... I've actually got the theory that Dark Nuts are the Illuminati. Taylor Swift is the Illuminati as well. We, we found that out uh, a while ago. Ignore what I'm saying! I don't even know this is even Mount Zelda! Okay, no, 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 I don't know. I don't... Yeah, because the Illuminati is totally about Zelda. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's, it's been proven. Alright, let's just focus on the dungeon, because when I go off on tangents, they're never fun. Uh... <laughs> Alright, down is the transitional area. This time we will not die to a keese, because that was incredibly embarrassing. I could have died to a keese there, that would have been very embarrassing. Uh, oh god, here come the Paul's voices. Kill as many as I can, just get to the freaking corner of the room. Uh, really don't want to lose any health. And in we go. Guess who the boss is? It's Four-Headed Gleok. If you couldn't tell by my little sidebar that I have on the video, yeah, Four-Headed Gleok is back. Oh, uh, two- uh, Gleok in general is back, and now he's four heads. But he's dead! Basically, Gleok is very easy if you have the blue mail and all the health in the world, because it's just literally a case of just hack and slash. We have now completed Dungeon 8, we have now got the Triforce of Wisdom complete, all eight pieces. We can take a look at that in our inventory, and then, look at that, full life. We're now gonna have to head off to Death Mountain. And I've never actually been to that area of the map before, so this is going to be a very first for all of us. There's the Triforce complete. Let's get our magic wand out, since I like my magic wand. And what we need to do is we need to head this way. We need to head back to where we got... Around the area where we, um... Got our first sword upgrade. Not the second upgrade, the first upgrade. Because... The area there leads up to Death Mountain, and if you know your Zelda, then you know Death Mountain is where... Ganon lives, and Ganon is the root of all evil in this series, and the root of all evil in this game. So we have to go and face him. Oh, and we've got to rescue some Zelda. 
Because obviously rescuing Zelda is just like a requirement these days. Even though I think she could probably get out herself. She needs a game, really. Zelda, Zelda needs her own game. That is something I will definitely attest. Uh, not attest to. That needs to happen. Uh, let's go this way. Uh, we need to go up to where this river crosses, but we need to go up one. We need to go and cross up here and climb up this. I actually haven't been to this bit before. I don't want to stay here, though. I want to climb up the stairs, because that's where we need to go. So let's climb up the stairs before the boulders fall down. And we're faced with some of these guys. Uh, if you recognize, these guys are the badass evil guys of uh, the last area in the Zelda area world. Death Mountain, yeah. And we're at Spectacle Rock. We're at the site of the final battle. Oh, it's going to be the site of the final battle. This is where we're going to face off. Not with not the Nicolas Cage film, but we're going to face off against Ganon. Because Death Mountain is hidden in one of these little spectacles. I'm trying to figure out which one it is. Not too sure. Alright, so... I think it's this one. There it is. There's the entrance. And we need to go over here, because we need to get some potions from this little shop here. And that's a lot of evil enemies that like, are the toughest enemies in game. And we literally have just enough rupees in order to buy the medicine, but we're not going to buy the medicine because we actually have the blue medicine, which we don't actually want to use up yet. So I'm going to go into Death Mountain in the final episode of this series. I thank you so much for watching. This has been Billabo 10,000 playing The Legend of Zelda. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to subscribe, comment, or like. Thank you so much for watching, and goodbye.